Welcome to Muggle Science. Let's talk about beryllium. In the periodic table, beryllium is the fourth element after hydrogen, helium, and lithium. Beryllium is the first of alkaline earth metals together with magnesium and calcium. Strong and stable, it is valued for its lightweight, stiffness, and other unique properties. Beryllium nucleus consists of four protons and five neutrons. The four protons are balanced by four electrons, two on the inner shell and two on the outer shell. Beryllium is quite uncommon. One ton of dirt contains only a few grams of beryllium. But in some places, it is concentrated as a mineral, such as beryl. When colorful, beryl is a valuable gemstone. Green beryl is called emerald. Aquamarine is blue. Yellow beryl is heliodor or gold beryl. And the red barrel is, well, just red barrel. The rarest and most expensive of them all. The secret to these colored gems is a small amount of chromium, iron or manganese mixed into barrel. Beryllium is widely used in x-ray machines because it is transparent to x-ray, just like window glass is transparent to visible light. Beryllium is used in airplanes and spaceships because it is very light and strong, especially if combined with other metals. These beryllium alloys are commonly used to make strong non-magnetic and sparkless hand tools. The famous Hubble telescope allows us to see stars and galaxies billions of light years away. The next generation telescope, the James Webb Telescope, will have not one, but 18 giant hexagonal mirrors, each made of beryllium and plated with gold. Beryllium was chosen because it is light, very stiff, and resists temperature deformation. We can't wait to see the images it will send back to Earth. But be careful, beryllium dust can lead to beryllosis, a nasty lung disease that can kill you. Some rare beryllium gems include Tafite, was gravite, Alexandrite. Which was named after Alexander II, the Emperor of Russia. Well, that's it for now. Bye! Bye.